you are probably thinking that's wrong you don't have to think so welcome to the episode number 24 of the podcast 24 or 25? I think it's 25. Should be 25. We lost the count. Yeah. So episode That's number 25, Road to, Suce- to Success, hosted by Lord of Bars. So, as Kali said, you don't have to overthink. You don't have to think at all. Yeah, you... Sometimes people get drive too much by their, uh, their mind, mm-hmm. instead of being drive by their emotion, actually. Because every time you think too much, you might lose a chance of doing something. I know that yesterday you were on the train and you were looking into an amazing girl and you said, I wish I could go to talk to, the, to this girl. Why you didn't? Why you didn't? What can happen? Nothing. Yeah. If, nothing. That's if, all. If you do nothing, nothing happens. Wow. Well, exactly. Like, and you already lost. If you do nothing, you have lost. Yeah. But if you try, maybe it goes good, maybe it goes bad, but you didn't lost your chance, you know? You never know. It's like half, half. Maybe she's the girl of your life. And you lost the chance. Yeah. And not just in, uh, in like, let's say, for girls and everything, but also in your uh, career. Sometimes you have to take the chance people throw into you. Like, uh, like you Ali did with me for coming here in Switzerland. I didn't think it twice. I said yes immediately. Always uh, in the right situation. You know? not just, yeah, I go. <laughs> but if you focus on the bad things, guys, uh, you're going to hit on the bad things. You don't tell even to the realize, to think, to visualize the bad things. Bad things doesn't exist. Because every problem has a solution. You go in a situation, there is a problem, perfect. You will find a solution. Because you're a man, you're a woman, you're a human, you can find a solution to problems. Because anyways, uh, with this decision or without, you're anyways going to face fucking problems yeah. so just do it that's an easy sentence that is from nike brand whatever it is i don't care you have to do things that comes in your mind and you don't have to overthink because overthink make just appear in your mind problem and problem and problem and problem more you think more you overthink less chance you're gonna get to actually do what you want to do exactly and even if you get something wrong you didn't lost anything you just learn something so it's not uh, about uh, embarrassing yourself or not being able to do something. It's just uh, actually just doing something will change your, your complete life, I think. Today I'm upset, guys. Today I'm upset, you can see that. But that's the point. Because I'm actually in the last months realizing the thing that we are actually talking about. It's obvious, but at the same time, not that obvious. Because we all know that, but no one actually do something about that. For example, the happens to me that I eat for the first time once on a girl that was working with me, okay? And I would never do that in the past because I would think, oh my God, if she says no, what I'm gonna do? We work together, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. I don't care, I don't care anymore. I wanted to do it, I did it. Try to guess, it was not as bad shot, you know? It was actually a good chance. Yeah. Then of course I'm a busy person and that's the problem, it's you know, that I should overthink before, but I don't have to do it, so I will not. Working. Yeah, and what's the last time that you were talked about something and uh, last turned out time to be bad? Last time that I overthought about something too much was like actually when I was working, when people were actually throwing me like offers or like a uh, better job or better position in my same job, but uh, I was just not getting it, you know, I was just too shy. What if I get in and I do something wrong? Or what if they don't like it? But actually, people don't care about that stuff. And right now, when people ask me something and throw me like some, some chances, you, mm-hmm. know, you can say, I, I take it immediately, you know, because if I goes wrong, I will learn something. Right. And yeah, at work, I always had uh, the chance to do something better or do something more and everything. But I always was overthinking, yeah, oh, maybe it goes wrong. Maybe they will fire me. Maybe with that, that, that. But it's not, uh, th- that's not the reality. That's just into your mind. So it's good having a good imagination, but it's not uh, that good in the reality. You must apply this concept to everything, to Instagram, to social media, to your perfect girlfriend, to your, the love of your life, uh, to your passion, to your work, whatever you want. You just need to do things because uh, if you do something, you will have a result. Good, bad, learning, not learning. At least something is going to happen. If you do nothing, nothing is going to happen. Yeah, and as Kali said, uh, visualizing is really a strong weapon. Because uh, think about it, uh, 
you already know that it's wrong because if you all the time think about uh, bad things or bad situations and stuff, they might happen, you know? Mm -hmm. Try to reverse that process and try to think like I will be a winner, I will be a champion, I will be successful, successful and all of this stuff. <laughs> you know what? You may be successful, you may be a champion, you may be win something. You know, as Tom, Tony Robbins said, I don't want to say actually the words because I maybe I'm going to ruin his words, but the concept is this one. Try to close your eyes. Imagine that maybe you're going to become a champion, okay? In this moment that you have this image of your mind, and I hope that you're actually visualizing it, champion, whatever, video editor, whatever it is, the best of your field, okay? In this moment, you're going to feel happy, but a, lit a little, you know, not completely satisfied. You're going to be worried. Try to imagine now, close your eyes, that 100% you're going to become the champion. You're going to feel a strength inside that this is actually the strength that you need every day to approach your day. So this is why visualizing is that important. If you can actually analyze the benefit of visualizing, just closing your eyes for five seconds, try to imagine for an entire life. And with this, I'm out from this speech. <laughs> so thanks for following up uh, also this episode and for all the other ones. I hope you enjoyed it. And see you in the next episode.